From VOA Learning English, this is the Agriculture Report. A grain called quinoa has become popular in many areas around the world. Quinoa is native to the Andes Mountains of South America. It grows near Lake Titicaca along the border of Peru and Bolivia. Historical evidence shows that local people were growing quinoa as far back as 5,000 to 7,000 years ago. During this period, they used both the seeds and leaves of this wild plant. There are many kinds of quinoa. The plant can be grown in different climates. And it does not require a lot of water. Both the seeds and leaves can be used as food. The seed is the most commonly used part. Quinoa seeds can be ground into flour or cooked whole. Quinoa is used in cereals, drinks, and fresh salads. It can also be mixed with vegetables or beans for a full meal. The leaves and stems can also be used as medicines. Some people use them to reduce pain, heal wounds, and keep insects away. Quinoa is full of amino acids and minerals. Amino acids are organic compounds that form protein. The body needs them to help break down food and to grow and repair tissue. The United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization believes that quinoa is important in the fight to end hunger. UN food officials believe the high value of protein provided by quinoa can help feed a growing world population. The grain has also become popular among those seeking healthier ways to eat. The center of the seed contains up to 45% protein. Quinoa is currently grown in more than 70 countries. Peru and Bolivia together produce 92% of the crop. The rest comes mainly from the United States, Ecuador, Canada, and Argentina. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.